Most people believe that the biggest hurdle will be the path to citizenship. Yeah. You have clearly said that it must in be included from the from the outset. Senator Marco Rubio says that he will not support a bill that does not put border security ahead of um, citizenship. Is this going to end up being a, a battle between you and Marco Rubio? No, I don't think so. Look, we've put border security ahead of pathway to citizenship. We have done more on border security in the last four years than we had done in the previous 20. We've seen a drop in terms of illegal crossings of about 80 percent since 2000. We have made enormous strides, put resources in. We've actually done almost everything that Republicans asked to be done right. several years ago as a condition to move forward on comprehensive immigration mm -hmm. reform. Mm -hmm. So what, given that that's the case, uh, it's not as if we haven't been attentive to border security, and we will continue to be attentive to border security. What we don't want to do is to create uh, some vague uh, prospect in the future mm -hmm. that somehow comprehensive immigration reform that includes a pathway to citizenship will happen, you know, mañana. Mm -hmm. We want to make sure that we're very clear that this legislation provides a real pathway. Now, that pathway will take some time. There, there, even under our proposal, this is not a situation where overnight suddenly people uh, all find themselves as citizens. They're going to have to earn right. their way to it, and they're going to have to go to the back of the line. We're going to have to clear out uh, the uh, you know, existing lines, backlog that we have in terms of legal immigrants, because they did it the right way. We shouldn't punish them uh, for not breaking the law. Right. Uh, so all those things are going to have to be put in place, but we have to put that into place at the outset and, and make sure that people are clear that this pathway is real and not just uh, a fantasy for the future.